you guys. Good morning. I brought you the bottom half of my uh, movie theater candy. Mm. You will not believe what happened to me this weekend. I met a cute guy at a bookstore. Oh. Like anyone who goes to the bookstore, I wasn't there to buy books. I do that on the internet at like 50% off and free shipping and no tax. Oh my God, $28.95 for a book? But luckily this time, I made an exception. Because if there's one thing that I can never resist, it's a good tote bag. Hey, are you gonna buy that book? I was thinking about it. I'm only asking because I have two books and you have one, so if we combine them, I could get a tote bag. But why wouldn't I get the free tote bag? Because you're a guy. What do you need a tote bag for? I can store all my tote bags I don't use in it. All right, well, um, I'm gonna go ask that old lady. Maybe she'll play ball. See ya. Well, wait, wait, wait. Maybe we can work this out. How? I'm thinking joint custody. You get the tote bag during the week, I'll take the tote bag on the weekends. Yeah, I can live with that. All right, great. Shall we go Shakespeare? No, no. I don't support Shakespeare. I heard a story that he didn't write any of his plays. He made his butler write them, and then he took all the credit. So you're saying the butler did it? That sounds pretty dumb. But if it is true, isn't that the most despicable thing you've ever heard? So, did you get your tote bag? Yeah, but you know what? It wasn't really that great, so I gave it to a homeless guy. But before that, he took me for frozen yogurt. Yeah, so that's when I decided that I wanted to be an architect. Mmm, milk. What's wrong? Mmm, nothing. It's just, it just doesn't really taste like key lime pie. It, don't worry about it. No, I am going to worry about it. Let's go fix this. This one's bad, too? Uh, come on, let's go. Mm. Are you kidding me? Do you maybe just hate yogurt? It's really good. Thank goodness. You know, in the end, this walk only cost me like $50. Um, it was worth it. I will pay for dinner. That only seems fair. What a nightmare. Four different stops just to ask you out. I mean, how much time does this guy have on his hands? Sounds like a bum. Uh, that's rude, and it's not true. Why? Because he does have a job. You guys, he's an architect. Oh, <gasps> an architect? I mean, come on, no one's really an architect. I mean, that's a job that guys have in the movies. Well, call me uh, Reese Witherspoon, because I'm going on a date with an architect tonight. Up here. Woo! Thank you. Come on, Danny. Yeah.